Okay, so this little story is um, this morning I was um, upstairs in the main kitchen um, doing dishes. And I generally try to do it early enough in the day that I'm reasonably sure nobody else is going to need the space. And so I kind of have it to myself. And I felt kind of intuitively guided to listen to a video about yoni egg use. I, um, I'll be honest, I've been having a lot of numbness in my body all over, but particularly in my yoni or pussy. I don't know what word I feel comfortable using yet. They all kind of <laughs> make me go, oh, I don't know. Um, uh, there's been a lot of numbness. Very little access to pleasure has been going on for a while. And so I remembered my yoni egg and I was like, well, you know what? It's a real easy thing to do. Um, I, it doesn't, I don't even have to know a lot about it. I know enough about it to know how to put it in and how to clean it and that kind of thing. But I don't need to know an, a ton about it in order to just use it. <laughs> just use it. So um, this morning I'm doing dishes and I'm watching a new person that I've started kind of following. I think she's super funny. It's super um, interesting. And she teach her YouTube channel is called Pussy Powered, I think. Um, but I will, uh, yeah. She so she shared. She was teaching about yoni egg, and she did a really good job. The one video I watched, it was a very very good intro. But there was enough info that like if you already have a yoni egg or feel like you know enough to get a good one, um, it, it would get you started. She, and she has a whole series, which I haven't watched yet. But so I'm about 10 seconds, 15 seconds into the video. And I'm like really excited to learn about it. I'm like, oh my God, yeah, I'm so really looking forward to getting back into a yoni practice. And, uh, and I kind of went, oh my God, did I put my yoni egg in yesterday? Holy shit. <laughs> it hasn't come out yet. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Number one, I forgot I had a yoni egg in. <laughs> number two, I'm really grateful I didn't drop it in the toilet after I did some number two. And, um, and uh, yeah, that's a long time for it to be in. And when she got to that section of the video where she's talking about how long to keep it in, she's like, yeah, I mean, I usually do it a couple hours. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't typically do it a real long time, she says, like overnight or anything, but you know, it's different practices. So I don't feel like I really did something wrong. It's just that I, that moment where I'm like, <laughs> I think my yoni egg is inside me from yesterday. <laughs> anyway, I sure that, yeah, I hope that story was funny for you too. Um, okay, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.